Here are the further adventures of Hagrid meeting Mistral for the first time. Hagrid is just chilling on Jacqueline's knee as we're driving toward the barn. He's such a good kitty in the car. As we arrived, Hagrid spotted some of the horses. That look says it all. Now Hagrid is voicing his opinion clearly on how he feels about being this close to Mistral. So we decide to give them some space. But he still was concerned and he had that look. Maybe carrying him was a far better idea. After a while, he thought he would like to walk, but he just couldn't resist the tall grass as he does love it. There he is. After coming out, he spotted Mistral coming up the road. So some loving was in order to make him feel more at ease. That did the trick and off he went to continue his adventure. Mistral was kept far back to give Hagrid a sense of safety and all was going very well. Dang it, there's that horse again. Mistral was being very well behaved, however, but still kept at a distance. Once again, Hagrid thought it a much better idea to be carried. When it was decided we should turn around and get back, Mistral was on the side of the road enjoying some grass with the girls. This time, Hagrid seemed a bit more relaxed about being close to Mistral. Hagrid was doing well until Jacqueline took him a little closer which he made clear wasn't his idea of okay. Hagrid watched with interest as he saw that his people were petting this big creature and then getting some loving himself. So it was thought at this point, because things were going well, it was now time to head back to the barn. When Mistral started to pass him, he wasn't so sure he liked this huge creature, but it was only a momentary thing and he soon found the cattle guard to be most intriguing. Hmm, what's in there? By then, Mistral was far down the road so when Hagrid spotted him again, he wasn't as bothered by seeing him. He was so relaxed now and most willing to be heading home. When he appeared tired, he was given a free ride the rest of the way. He had quite the adventure, but was ready to go home and chill.